Hello people, welcome to Tata Electronics and today we'll be talking about uh, the HC05 model. I got mine and uh, since it was my first time I got it fried. I felt really bad and I have to go online to see if uh, I could get a better one. So after reading online, I discovered that this was actually one of the best and uh, I also realized that it has a voltage regulator which is located somewhere here. Um, if you can see, you can see that I actually removed the voltage regulator because mine got shunted and uh, there was no output from it. So. What did I do? You can look very closely, you discover that I'm having a loop from the V in to the V out. This is the actual terminals of the voltage regulator. I have V in, V out, and the ground. So initially, mine got shorted between the V in and the ground. So since I could not find this very surface mount device in our local market, I remove it and I connected the V in to the V out. So here is how this uh, voltage regulator look like. So and then after that uh, I knew very well that the voltage regulator was no longer there so I was very conscious of uh, powering it up. So without this main uh, this power this is a voltage sorry this is a 5 volt regulator um, before I included this 5 volt regulator I tried to power this uh, module with um, with 3 volts and uh, surprisingly it didn't work the 3 volt I got it from this power supply this power supply has been modified internally and is very stable and, uh, and when I tried to power it with 3 volts it didn't work I power with 4 volt. It started blinking. The Bluetooth started blinking, but still I couldn't find it. It was blinking abnormal. So I decided to include this uh, voltage regulator, which is a 5 volt regulator, because I didn't want it to exit 5 volt. I now move it to 6 volt on my uh, power supply. So the voltage regulator here step the voltage down. To around 4.8 also and then the Bluetooth module started blinking normal so let me just power it up so that you see I'm taking it back to 3 volt sorry I'm using one hand to record so 3 volt on you can see this LED is not part of the circuit just a indicator for this um, 5 volt main regulator so the bluetooth module did not blink i now increase it to 4.5 it did not blink but initially when i connected from this power supply directly to the module it blinks but it wasn't normal so i will now move it to 6 volt and that 6 volt and then it peak and started blinking normal so in excellent what I'm trying to tell you that don't just throw this module away, make sure you exhaust all means of uh, trying to troubleshoot it to make it work. We have um, a voltage regulator here and a diode that you can check and once you find out that these components are bad, you can replace them or you can manipulate it to save your money. Thank you very much for watching and I hope this video will help someone out there. Thank you.